like from the time that we were little kids, what was it that we heard every night at about 9, 9.30? Give me a beer. <laughs> no. <Nope. laughs> I want some crack. Five o'clock comes early. Early, yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm and like Grandpa that. would get up and go to bed, and that was it. Poof, you never saw him. But I'm talking like we're seven, six, whatever years old. Grandpa was still going to bed at at nine thirty or whatever. Nowadays, that's late for him. But yeah. Mm -hmm. He hasn't been to bed since seven thirty. Oh, he, he said that ever since he got out of the Navy, he could never sleep much past about three o'clock. Five o'clock comes early. Five o'clock comes early. <laughs> okay, Dad. Um, I, I think one of my best favorite memories of Grandpa is just when they first moved to Naples, and he was buddy with Harry, and we'd go down, and all the great times we had fishing out at the Port of the Isles out there. On? Man, we just. We'd go every day on the vacation, catch a lot of fish, and drink beer, and have a good time. It was mm -hmm. just fun. Boy, listen to the wind out there. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Huh? Hollywood. Well, my, one of my favorite members of memories that I have of Grandpa goes along with what Dad was saying with Harry. And I remember him going, and it was in the place where they lived before where they live now. And they caught a shark. Oh, and we I was thinking of that one too. Christmas, and the shark was laying there. That was a doorknob. But I, I don't know. I didn't know I was a kid or, you know. And I kicked the shark. And it was. the shark. Well, the shark. I don't know. It was, and it was just me. Well, I did after I, I kicked it because yeah, I got freaked out. But I kicked it and it just kind of wiggled. And I thought that it was alive and I thought it was going to bite my leg off and I remember being freaked out and grandpa saying, Oh no, 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 that's that's it. And then my favorite memories of grandma are well most recently how much grandma has gotten onto the computer and the cards that she sends, the personalized things, the care that she puts into those. Um, as well as just being able to communicate with her on that and know what she's doing and know that she's out there doing her own thing and, and getting around and I don't know, I just enjoy knowing that I can post something on Facebook and know that my grandmother will see it. Yeah. And I just think that that's really cool. Yeah, that's funny. I think that and, 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 so, well, and I think that the coolest thing cool about it head. is that I'll post something, and if she gets around to it, maybe she'll see it. But she's way too advanced on the damn thing that I am. And, you know, I, I don't know how to actually get the message to her because she's too far past what I'm doing. But that's, that's my favorite. Dan. Dan. Hmm? Oh, Okay. Um, well, same, same year that the shark was caught, because I remember that getting caught and remember it tasting phenomenal. Um, shark. I don't remember eating the shark. I remember yeah. eating shark. Um, I do too. It's like chicken. Yeah, it was phenomenal. But uh, either way, Uncle D or Grandpa, Matt and Paul all decided to play a joke on me where they convinced me that the Portuguese man of war was God. <laughs> <laughs> and he lived on the top of the Silver Dome. And his name was Jimmy something. Yes. Louis but, Louis Vincenzi. Louis Louis Vincenzi. Yeah, I remember <laughs> that. <laughs> Completely convinced about this Portuguese man of war being the being God. I also remember poor kids been screwed up the entire <laughs> rest of the sick. This is sick. Oh hell, Portuguese man of war. But me and Josh write a book. We start would, a call. We're just amazed at the strength of Grandpa. We'd be like seven-year-old kids, and there's pictures of us doing this all the time, where we're like the handshake holding thing. on, pulling away. It's, Two of us at the same time, like, we can get you. I'm, like, trying to pull away from him, and he's sitting down, Miller, Miller High Life in one hand, and holding the two <laughs> And um, we're just, and then, the, of course, the hand trick. We, I, I had forced Dad to teach me that over time, and I became his apprentice after he was Grandpa's <laughs> apprentice. But it's a Sith thing. Yeah. And then the, the Grandma playing off on that stuff, I mean, the, the church, <laughs> 
all of us shirts great. one year. Oh, yeah. I, I oh, got, so they were specialized yeah. shirts for yeah. each person. <laughs> Music is the ear of the beholder. And, and, and that's what I got. Every single year, we, that's the first, like, that's the most memorable present possibly ever by anybody. And, I mean, there was, I've got you in my sights, just skate it, dude. <laughs> Music, I remember Music is in the ear of the beholder, yeah. Sad. And then That's cool. the skateboard being pink, yeah. I remember that much. That, was, uh -huh. that is so the cool. The whole thing that. Mm -hmm. was awesome. And, and, then, and, and every year we talk about I forgot that, that, but you're absolutely year. right. And now that you mention it, I, I certainly remember it. It's really cool. And Josh is up next. We all <laughs> open the presents up together. I yeah. That. I guess uh, nothing pales in uh, comparison to the night that they sat me down and they said, You are our favorite. <laughs> 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 and I said, really? And they said, oh, absolutely. <laughs> and then they said, they said the first three months have been care of us in our old age. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> I can't, I mean, there's, there's so many, like, memories, I can't think of anyone of the <laughs> I think of, quietly. Um, <laughs> man, if you could zoom in. <laughs> um, no, but, Fake the tears, yeah. Josh. Fake the tears. <laughs> and this one time. <laughs> Watching cartoons with Grandpa. And oh my God! That's really good. And I mean, just being able to sit down and talk to, to Grandma and Grandpa on just uh, an adult level, and um, you know, just with you being the adult. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> None of the roles are reversed. No, I'm just joking. So, um, it's just kind of a lot of rambling, but like, they're great people, and I love them very much. Wrap it up. <laughs> no, I understand why they said I was the favorite. <laughs> okay, this goes back to when we three were kids. And this was kind of a, um, a typical way that we would go to the store. If we were all out in the car, and it was it would have been a Ford of one type or another, we would stop at the corner grocery store about four blocks down. Dad would always stay in the car. And us kids would stay in the back seat of the car. Mom would always go in to get milk or bread. Well, funny thing was, it would always take, oh, somewhere near a half hour for Mom to get milk or bread because she, just like Grandpa Gurney, she'd want to talk and be chatty and friendly with all the people in there and the store clerks and everything. And we would just say, stay in the car. Dad would always tell us the stories about growing up or the Navy or different stories. And... We would always, he would turn the radio on at a certain time when we started getting kind of tuned into music. And I remember Sherry Baby by the um, Four Seasons. And Dad would turn the radio and us three kids would be in the back. Mom would be in having fun talking. Dad would be having fun with us kids telling stories. And the music would be on and the three of us would be in the back seat. And they having fun. So it was a great growing up there. And, and so that's the first thing I thought of was staying in the car while Mom went in to get milk and bread for a half hour. <laughs> <laughs> you got to tell yours over, Mom. You know I can't do that. Um, I have two favorite memories. Um, my first one is Christmas uh, four years ago now that we went to Florida and spent with you know the family and spent at Grandma and Grandpa's and it was just you know a lot of fun and Florida style Christmas. And it was nice to be with, with them and, you know, spend the holidays with them. And my other favorite is my ring, being passed down the ring. And it means oh, I mean, a lot to me, and it's very special. And so that's, that's my girl. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to repeat mom since she won't do it, too, because that was a hilarious story. So I'm going to pretend to be Laura Rayner. I, I can't do that, man. Okay. That, that is a funny, funny story, so um, either way. I don't know it, but I'm telling it from the point of view of mom, so give me a minute on that one. But mm -hmm. uh, Mom was, I guess Dana was sitting at the top of the hill, and Eric and, Eric and Bud were down at the bottom of the hill. They were watching, uh, watching us. I guess Dana was running down the hill, and her legs kept going longer and longer, and she, I, I think she did the typical Dana face. That. <laughs> I guess Grandma decided that at one point started laughing, 
and for three hours my mom said she couldn't look at grandma without laughing and grandma would start laughing too because she laughed the whole time as Dana nearly paled over and um, I guess grandma almost peed herself too and <laughs> this was all going on as well. And See, I, I didn't her. think it was an almost. No. <laughs> Matt, you can fix that now that right? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Matt, did you do yours? Put an ass over teacups here. I got you. See, and, and you guys didn't get to see the look coming down the hill. Hold on. Because <laughs> on the bottom side of the hill, it was like, you know, Dana, Dana when she would get, like, uh, excited or something like that, it just, her eyes would get bigger. And then her mouth would come open. And so by the time that she went, went diving, it was like... <laughs> <laughs> Um, my favorite memory of Grandma and Grandpa's would be just uh, when I was little going over there uh, watching cartoons and uh, having Grandpa carry me in the house and, uh, and I'd play with the Evil Knievel thing oh, in yeah. there and, uh, and about, um, about um, the, um, and then uh, I guess that's it. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Grandpa and Grandma. We love you guys. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Jimmy says Merry Christmas. 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 Merry